What is going on, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to the vlog. It's another beautiful day in New York City, as per usual. Today, we decided to do something a little different. We want to take advantage of this beautiful day and spend most of it by the water. So today, we're going to take a ferry all the way from Manhattan to Brooklyn. So apparently, unbeknownst to me, there's a ferry that takes you from uptown, Upper East Side, or the East River, all the way to Astoria, Roosevelt Island, all the way down to Brooklyn and the bottom of Manhattan. And all the years I've lived here, I can honestly say I've never been on the ferry or even knew about the ferry. So this will be my first experience. We came all the way up to the Upper East Side and we're gonna take the ferry all the way down to Brooklyn and spend the day down there because Andrana, for some reason, having lived in New York City her entire life, has never been to the Brooklyn Bridge. I mean, seriously? And we're on. finished our first ferry ride ever. How would you rate your first experience? Honestly, a 10 out of 10. Can't complain. Yeah, I mean, the views you get on the water and also it only being $2.75 for that ride, I don't know. Highly so, recommend. Yeah, 10 out of 10. Would do again. Did you get it yet? Yeah. Ready? And as you know, the first thing to do when you get off of a ferry in Brooklyn is to get a city bike so you can explore easily. weekend we decided not to do anything this weekend because we were going to go to the Hamptons, we were going to go to Newport, Rhode Island, we were going to go a million different places but we decided ultimately just to stay here and enjoy our time together in the greatest city in the world. Just look at these views. We have the iconic Brooklyn Bridge right here, Freedom Tower again up there, and of course I get to spend them with my lovely wife. So we're just gonna continue to bike around here, explore all the scenery, I'll bring you guys along for the ride. The best part about today is we literally have no plan. We're just kind of winging it. We haven't been to Brooklyn in a while and we're going to officially ride across the Brooklyn Bridge going back into Manhattan shortly. But we're gonna explore around here a little bit, maybe get some food, maybe get some drink. We'll see what happens. many of you all have seen this spot on Instagram. It is the Manhattan Bridge. You can see the Empire State Building in between the two frames here. I took a picture way back when in like 2014, 15 or something. It's on the way down in my Instagram. I'll show you off. But back when I came here, nobody was around these spots. And now it's like an Instagram haven. As you can see right here, there's like a million photographers day in and day out here trying to get photos. Most 
What is it? Maple shea latte. <laughs> so now we just got some coffee and we're gonna watch all the uh, Instagrammers up here take photos with their balloons. Even though I used to do that too. But times have changed and no one wants to see that anymore. But in all seriousness, Am I the only one that's sick of seeing posed traveling photos? The travel photos, you know what I'm talking about, where they're like, they make a bed, like on the edge of a cliff, and they like lay there acting like they're comfortable. Meanwhile, they're not comfortable at all. I don't know, I just, I'm so sick of seeing that. First part is uphill, and then you get these incredible views at the top. Hold on a second. Cue the incredible views right now. Statue of Liberty over there. We have the Empire State Building Upper East Side over there. And then obviously the beautiful southern tip over here. It is absolutely gorgeous on the Berkeley Bridge today. All right, so we ended up biking all the way across the Brooklyn Bridge and we biked into Soho and somehow we ended up on the Kith Shop. So obviously we had to go in there. And then we ended up going to Supreme, and then another stop, and another stop. The next thing you know, I'm starving, and haven't eaten in six or seven hours. So now we are at. Oh, you can't see it. Gray Dog. The Gray Dog in Soho. I used to come here way back in the day. Back when I first used to come up here in like 2008, 2007. And it's like a little sandwich spot. So we're gonna have a few sandwiches, some cocktails, of course. And. Enjoy the rest of the evening. Mm. Okay, much needed after a long day of biking across the Blickham Bridge. Fries. <laughs> so, we were going home and we made a little pit stop here at the Rin, which has a very special place in our heart because we got engaged here, which I'll link a video right now. So you can see our quick little engagement. But this is exactly where we got engaged. This is exactly where we right did some, some engagement photos right over here. I'll show you the video right now. <laughs> oh. We officially finished our cocktail extravaganza in our day all around the city. We are about as dead as it gets right now. <laughs> Actually, not as dead as it gets. I feel pretty good right now. I could have some more cocktails, but I feel great. I feel, yeah, I feel never been better. We are just going to go walk back. Probably have a cocktail on the rooftop and then call it a night. We have more festivities going on tomorrow. So it is officially a new day and this place may look familiar because I was here yesterday but we're actually taking the ferry back over to Astoria today to meet up with some of our friends and we're gonna have a nice little barbecue in their backyard and it'll be a nice little Labor Day get together and all that stuff. I was planning on filming like the whole weekend or so. I was planning on filming like the whole weekend but then I was putting some of the videos together today and it was already like well over 10 minutes and this would have been like a 20 minute vlog and nobody wants to see that because you guys can only watch me for like 8 minutes at a time before you get bored. So I'm going to go ahead and end the vlog here. Make sure you smash the like, subscribe button, follow me on Instagram if you don't already. And I'll see you all on the next video. Happy Labor Day.